reasons or for whatever okay. reason. Okay, come curse Jack or on Bertag or of Agiv. Yes, I'm trying to get this all right because, of course, you're the new Aaron of Gaelic. Mm -hmm. Will Gaelic Agat will to leave us. So you're going Gaelic, um, but I learned my leaving cert Irish. Um, so it's 30 years ago since I did my leaving cert. Um, so obviously. I still have that Irish in me. Uh, I did study it for about 12 years at honours Irish level. So uh, I then did a degree in languages, French and German, before I studied law for 20 so years. So will you be so learning Irish Language is something now? that's very important to me. Well, you know, uh, Joe McHugh has dedicated statutory responsibility for the Gael Duct. I'm not going to make a promise that I'm going to study Irish in case I cannot follow it through. But obviously, it's, I'm, I'm very passionate about languages has, in general. He? he does, yeah, and he's incredible. He's exemplary um, in the standard that he's set, as is Joe McHugh. Um, but, you know, your I'm love... Your lo one, your uh, love uh, uh, it's Nguelga. Blia Nguelga yeah. next year, yeah, and I'm really looking forward to that. Um, but I think, you know, your, your, your proficiency and fluency in, in a language doesn't mean that you don't love the language. So obviously I would have been quite proficient some 30 years ago. So yeah, I probably, I probably will uh, try and endeavour to... Um, could always Make go it a little bit stronger, yeah, Christmas absolutely. Holidays. But my <laughs> sons, I went to the Gaelic every year as a child to Clóis to Rinne and Clóis to Ciarán, and my sons go now every year as well. So I have a great love of the language. David Farrell, Blian the Gaelic and Taoiseach learning Irish. We're not sure whether the minister will, but she's well disposed. What I have a lot of sympathy it? for the minister. I haven't got a word of the language myself. Really? <laughs> well, maybe a word, but that's about as far as it goes. In my era, you didn't have very good Irish teaching in schools, and I went away for twenty years to Britain. And one of the, one of the uh, abiding memories I have when I came back in 2009 was just how much the language had caught on in the time I was away. I spent 20 years in Britain saying to people, sure hardly anyone speaks the language here. I think more do now than they used to, but Even I think to Tusk. define our nationhood, I know it's in the Constitution, I fully accept that, I'm a political scientist, I read it like everybody else, but to define our nation by our language I think is oversimplifying things. Okay, but that's, you're right, Donald Tusk was saying. He can manage it, I think. Caleb, we, we that was, um, th there's an Irish guy in his, on his staff, isn't there, that yeah. came up with all of that. All right, Gormila Mahalga Bugler uh, for joining us this Sunday. Thank you to all of you at home as well uh, for watching, and we will see you at the same times next week. So until then, from all the team, Slonga Ford.